Alright, so I'm basically talking about the two different modes or two different games that I'm releasing. One is called Patrolling What the Hell, and the, and the other one is just called Patrolling the Game. Um, the main core game, whoops, that was uh, just showing you something there, but I'll get back out to that in another second. So, this right here is basically the free game that I'm going to be releasing, um, which is a trimmed down version of the main core game, um, which will actually be this right here. Um, of course, the UI is going to change a little bit. I may change the background so you can know the difference between the two games. Um, one, so the main, the core game itself has, you know, pretty much still, uh, has a the whole story mode, which is if you go to casual. I'm going to change the, the boarding probably. This is just for me right now. BTM means nothing right now. New level again. These are all these most of these uh, things that I have here is from me for testing to make it easy for me to get into certain areas to test things and see how things work or don't work. Um, the boss mode I created basically so I can actually jump to a boss and see how the boss mechanics is and then what I need to tweak when I actually adjust certain settings in a boss. Uh, what the hell mode is actually what's going to be on the next game. So what the hell is basically it was, some, it was another test zone I was testing and I said mm, let me break it off into its own game and something that I can just release out there in the wild for free. Um, well, with ads, <laughs> we'll see how that plays out. I'm going to try to work that in, um, to pretty much try to bring in audience to make them be aware of my game quickly. Cause you know, I'm taking a little bit more time to finish up the main core game. Cause there are a few things that I want to do and I just don't think I'll have the time to, if I try to rush it out, I'm going to take my time on this one and then release the other one in the meantime. Um, so I'll just jump into this as people have already seen this, the, 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 the main core game itself has a whole story base. I actually removed the, there's another screen when you press casual, I turned it off because basically it was causing a bug for something else that I was doing. So I said, okay, let me just turn it off for the time being until I fix that bug. But what you, it does know when you jump in, it you know, gives you a little training of how your controls are and you know, it gives you a little dialogue box and blah, 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 blah. And of course, as you can see, it has, you know, your, um, your energy bar. So there are two, one, the top one, represents your your life or your, sh your main shield and um, the bottom represents your weapons the yellow represents your weapons and your attack your attack gauge so say for example if I was to well like it's not deflecting anything right now because I'm in an easy level it's more like a training zone um, and you take a, a considerable amount of damage if you don't have your shields up so you're pretty much again the top is your armor the yellow represents your shield and weapons, pretty much any energy based things. So if you're against so you taking heavy damage and uh, when you do die, I'm going to just try to kill myself. I'll turn it up a little bit. But this part is actually, I love it. When you die and you, you res resurrect kind of, you have that little teleporting sound from Dragon Ball. Yeah, I'm going to throw that in there. I may change it, but I like that. I like that sound anyway. So that's pretty much a premise for that game. It's for this mode itself. What again, the main game has the whole package, the whole deal. The other game that I'm releasing is just simply just uh, geared towards a point system, which is not in the main, which is not in the main game as yet. I, because I changed a lot of things. It's its own, um, I would say, um, production. You know, if, uh, if you notice, uh, this section here in the oh, we're making in the game maker is a lot less trimmed down than the actual core game one because basically I have a lot more rooms a lot more going on this I trim down and just make it a separate package itself and then I just export things back and forth to the packages um, so let me go back here restart go back back to the title so of course you know this is all gear this is the what hell mode is is a is, mu is a much faster game than the main game itself it's all about deflecting or defense and uh you have a you have 60 seconds to actually score your points uh, no well 60 seconds is what i put it at right now it may change um but that's what i have it at right now, at this current time and uh, you try to get a you know a high score and so forth. And again, the UI is still a working UI, so I'm going to change things as accordingly. This just I just drew this up just so for the sake of using something. Um, but that's pretty much what I, that's the one I'm working on mostly right now, quickly, so I can get it out the door. You know, I'm trying I'm trying my best to get it out this month. Um, 
because basically it's something that I just, I just want to put out and get it out there in, into some people's hands. Um, of course, you know, it's being done in Game Maker Studio 1.4, but to actually release it on Android, it has to be exported through Android Studio latest build, which is in Game Maker Studio 2, which I do have. So I'll be releasing it on that platform. Um, but I like building it in 1.4. 1.4 seems to be uh, more user friendly to me. In my case, you know, there are more, there are more options in, in 2.1, but I'm not familiar with 2.1 as yet. So once I am, uh, my next game will be built in that. But right now, since I'm so more familiar with 1.4, that's what I'll be doing it with. Um, so pretty much that was just a quick rundown because I wanted to make sure I show the differences between the two games, um, or two game modes. So the audience actually can know right away. And they're like, oh, oh, this is a different game. Well, it's different to some degree because of how it plays but again once this works i'm going to send it all everything over to the main game um and that's going to be in just for the what the hell mode itself this way you know what if you have the main game you don't need to have both you just have one game that has everything um but if uh, f for the time being the what the hell mode would be the one that i'm releasing early er, so to speak and uh, of course it would be a different apk yeah, that's all I have to say, and uh, hopefully, you know, it's, you know, yeah, well, and I'm not even concerned if it's liked or not, it's just more about gauging the audience to see what it is that they're willing to play. Alright, peace.